pivot tables are versatile because they let you easily analyze summaries of large amounts of data by using a variety of summary functions. Excel 2013 makes creating a new pivot table a snap with its new Quick Analysis tool. First, select the data, including the column headings, in your table or list as a cell range in the worksheet. Click the Quick Analysis tool in the lower right corner of the current cell selection. The palette of options opens. Next, click the Tables tab at the top of the palette to display the Table and Pivot Table option buttons. The Table button previews how the selected data will appear formatted as a table. The other Pivot Table buttons preview the various types of pivot tables that can be created from the selected data. Hover your pointer over any Pivot Table button, and Excel's Live Preview feature displays a thumbnail preview. When you find the pivot table you want, click its button. Excel 2013 then creates the selected pivot table on a new worksheet that's inserted at the beginning of the current workbook. From here, you can rename and relocate the sheet, as well as edit the new pivot table. Another way to generate a new pivot table is with the new Recommended Pivot Tables command button. To use this method, select a cell in the data list. On the Ribbons Insert tab, click Recommended Pivot Tables. Excel displays a Recommended Pivot Tables dialog box. Here you see a list box with all the suggested pivot tables. Simply select the sample you want to create, and then click OK. Excel creates the new table and inserts it in front of the others in your workbook. This pivot table is selected on the new sheet so that the Pivot Table Fields task pane is displayed on the right side of the worksheet window and the Pivot Table Tools Contextual tab is displayed on the ribbon. You can use the options on this task pane and contextual tab to customize your new pivot table.